Unit 16, question 56. So this is a genetics question. Um, talking about allele, cystic fibrosis. Uh, one in 20 Australians is a carrier of the defective allele. Um, and so are heterozygous for it. So, but the question is, um, if so if you chose people at random, what is the chance um, that they would have cystic fibrosis? So chose it at random. So if you were chosen at random, then the mother, um, the mother would have a, a one in 20 chance of uh, being a carrier, right? Because one in, one in 20 Australians are heterozygous uh, for the condition. And, um, and uh, the father would also, if chosen randomly, random male, would have a one in 20 chance of being uh, heterozygous for the condition. So, um, Heterozygous for the condition means that we're going to do an A cross uh, A. So this would be heterozygous. So we're going to do a, uh, um, a Punnett square. And we have uh, A, 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 and A. Now, uh, let's consider this for a moment. If, um, if the... Um, if a person is heterozygous uh, for the condition, so that this person was chosen randomly, one in 20 chance, then um, what is the chance that this person has a normal allele is going to be one in 40. And the chance that this allele is abnormal is one in 40. And so if uh, for this allele as well, it's one in 40. And for this allele, it is one in 40. And so the, the chances that two people who are heterozygous and mate are end up having a child that is homozygous um, for the uh, condition, homozygous uh, and will not have the disease and will not be uh, carriers, obviously, um, we can calculate it this way. But that's not what we're looking for. We're looking for that they actually have the disease. So this is how we uh, multiply it. And we have 1 in um, 1600 and AA. And uh, these would be heterozygous, heterozygous, homozygous, but without the condition. But this is uh, what we are looking for.